Hello everyone, how's it going? Welcome back to another Banny episode of Fisher Online. Today I'm going after the European Gar. I'm going after Sturgeon. I'm not sure if I'll be able to catch any. And I will be going for the mullets, the other smaller fish. Once again, I am on the deep end of this map here. Uh, K... K10, as in KGB10 in the deep hole here uh i ended up catching the gar whoops not with this uh the gar with this setup here uh 15 kg line 43 kg leader for some reason let's go ahead and put a 14 so with a 43 kg leader and an atom js18 a gram i ended up catching a garfish it was a non-marker however I'm um, just casting this way and just full send it and then retrieve as you usually do. And so I'm going to just tend to this. Uh, I'm using Shiner on the middle rod here uh, with a lucky ground bait, 15 or 14.5 kg liter with Shiner. That's where I'm catching majority of the fish. I'm getting a uh, different smaller fish like the mullet uh, palingus and the mullet some other type uh, i just don't want to show the scoreboard right now <laughs> uh that's for later you know uh here's another one and then on my first rod here i'm using mollusk pieces for the persian sturgeons because you're supposed to get them and uh when it's when it will be nighttime i'll be using a bunch of giblets hopefully get a wealth catfish uh, so stay tuned and uh, watch these cool clips and at the end you will see how much I've earned in however long I was here and what cool fish I've caught. Thank you so much for watching guys. Stay tuned. Like, subscribe, comment. Look at this guys. First cast. First cast and I finally get the stupid thing. Wow. Garfish European garfish. That looks so cool. Wow. Ooh, we got something bigger here now. What is this? Large Pontic Shad. Uh, this guy looks pretty dead because his fins are all like together. And it's all divided up. It's like he's been sitting out of the water for a long time. But wow, okay, I'll take it. Oh, 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 we got, we got something, we got something. On Shiner. Let's see what we got here. This one has a small leader. Uh, my spinning rod, as I've already mentioned, 43 kg leader. And this guy put like a 14 kg leader on the Shiner, I think. So even the smallest fish are going to be a challenge here. Let's see what this is. I'm kind of excited to see it. It's too big to be a guard, though. Uh, I don't think gars on this map get too big. And uh, they're going to be pretty weak fish. Yeah, that's not a gar. I don't know what that is. Oh, this thing again a large flat head mullet to kg <laughs> he's ready for flight <laughs> once again we get something here I'm gonna put this down okay looks like a 2 kg kg fish again on the first rod on your right it there, again, I know I must mentioned this before, a uh, bunch of gizzards or giblets, actually. That's for uh, the Wells catfish, but I think that's only going to be a nighttime thing. So maybe I should change it. I'm not sure. I'm going to keep it on for now, though. Another mullet Pringles. Okay, not too bad. There goes our... Shiner again. Uh, 
I'm gonna put this one on. I uh 15 kg liter. Okay, okay. I thought I had a 43 kg liter on this guy. I'm gonna cast him, I'm gonna put him down. We're gonna go ahead and do this. I know uh the segment right before this one. I said on the right I have a giblets. Uh right after that I ended up changing them to mollusk pieces. Because uh, this is also where the sturgeons bite. <clears throat> uh, so we should hopefully get a Persian sturgeon. Maybe. Uh, doesn't hurt to try. Like I mentioned many times before, if you know spots, please let me know. I'd love to check them out and share with everyone. Another mullet Pringle, I would say. Yes, 5.3 large. Give me a trophy already. I keep getting large ones. Give me a trophy. Come on, let's go. Okay, as soon as I put the rod down, guys, I got another bite. Uh, another mullet Pringles. You know what? Let me look at its spelling so I can properly pronounce it for once. Large mullet Pilingus. Okay, that's not much different. <laughs> Ooh, a flounder. We did catch this in our last episode, a large Glossa flounder. I think it was relatively uh, a worthless fish, unfortunately, but there you go. Um, on the large Shiner, uh, we ended up getting a flounder. Look at this. Everything's a big fish except for the garfish, which was a non-marker, and a mullet lingus. Interesting, interesting. Okay, well, let's uh, continue fishing. Ooh, right, bef right before the boat. Large Pontic Shad. Another dead fish. Why is it not swimming? Why does it feel like this was left on the floor for some time and it's just a put? <laughs> but you know what? We got large Pontic Shad. Cool, I'll take it. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Ooh, mollusk pieces. Oh no, we got something small on the mollusk. No. No, why? I should have wrecked my reel. Oh man. The heck is this? Oh. Bluefish, you stupid worthless thing. Wow, 1,000 experience? Really? Damn. Uh, but that sucks on the big hook on Mollusk. I ran out of my sturgeon at bait, unfortunately, so... Uh, I'm not gonna go back, buy the ingredients, and make new one. Because I don't even remember what the ingredient contained. Uh, but I'll just use Lucky Fishing for now, and then whenever I remember when I'm on land, I'll make more Sturgeon uh, Ground Bait. Very, very expensive to make. Uh, but wow. Got a bluefish. We, we've, we're catching many different species of fish, which is good. Uh, but I just, I need a Sturge. Oh, another Flounder. Uh, 2 kg large glossa flounder. Nice. Ah, damn! Right off the bat, we got something. Wow, that was a strong bite. What is this? Is that a bluefish? No, yes, that is. 5 kg large bluefish. All of a sudden it's bluefish time. Okay. Very interesting. You know, we're constantly getting fish here. Uh, shiner is the most active. So if you had 3 rods with shiners, I'm sure uh, your brain would be hurting right now. Because all of your rods would be going off. All the time. <laughs> so... Let's see here. Is this a bluefish as well? Looks like it. Look at that bluefish. They're like coming in 
in a school there's like a school of bluefish that's hovering around my boat and that's how i got them all of a sudden and then the two flounders as well okay this is exciting what do we got on our mollusk piece nothing oh maybe a small sturge For a moment, I, oh no, is that a bluefish? Looks really small and slender. Yes. Damn it! Roar! That's a Pringle. Stop eating my mollusk pieces, you little... 5 kg. What's wrong here? 42 kg line, 43 kg leader, lucky fishing, mollusk pieces, big hook. Why? Why are you doing this to me? Oh! What the heck is this? A large Pontic Shad. Okay. For a moment, I, all I could see was a slender fish with a black top hair. Like, it was just black. And I'm like, what the heck is this? That's a Pontic Shad. Oh, look at this. Look at this. European Garfish. A second one. But man, it's still non-marker. Why? Why? Do I need like a... Uh, no, I can, there are no hooks for me to select. But man, that's nice. This is the spot for them. Even though it's very rare too. Look at this. This is a really big flounder, I think. 2 kg Glossa flounder. Uh, What's the trophy size? Oh man. 3 kg. Okay. Okay. Well, that's good. Uh, also, guys, look at this. Uh, uh, where's the Pontic Chad? Pontic Chad, not a trophy, but I'm in the weeklies. So this is a good spot for Pontic Shads, I would say. Uh, European Garfish, unfortunately, I'm not here. Uh, I tried the Cyclops M2, didn't get much, so I just stopped using it. I'm just using JS18 Gram, and I'm also using Shiner because I want the Garfish. But you know what? I'm kind of wanting to use Nereus Ner Ner because a few fish you can catch on Nereus. So let's go ahead and um, switch. Oh, I had a fish on this whole time. Okay, let's switch over to the Nereus and see uh, what changes. Garfish, uh, screw it, you know, on uh, spinning, if I can catch it, I'll catch it. Uh, but because I'm exploring, finding spots, let's go ahead and uh, switch it up. That's a bluefish. Looks like a bluefish. It is. Look at how much XP they give. Man, I hope they're worth money because, damn, 1000 XP is amazing. Uh, let's go ahead with... There he is. Uh, small hook. I wonder if I use medium hook, will I get bigger fish? Will I get like a trophy bluefish? That'll be interesting. Okay, so Nereus, go. And see how that goes. Uh, for the sturgeons, I cast it over there with the mollusk, but I don't know if I'm going to get anything. Pretty soon when it's evening time, uh, I'm going to switch this up with giblet so we can go after the Welsh catfish. Okay. I just casted the, the Nereus, and uh, there we go. We already got a fish. So you know what? This spot is pretty good. Uh, I know this is the, like the first fish on Nereus, but uh, the Nereus and the Shiner, absolute good baits for bottom fishing if you want the smaller fish. Amulet Pringles. Let's go ahead and do medium hook. Let's do that and see if that changes anything. Okay, it's at 18 and uh, let's wait and see. A decent sized hair. 5.2 kg mullet lingus. Not quite. Ooh, a Xander. Look at this. Now that it's night time, we are getting the nocturnal fish. 5.8 kg large sander. Wow. 
on the shiner and i just completed my daily quest catch any fish 48.9 kg look at this wealth's catfish is now on too ah one minute 41 seconds left what not happening uh but man i wish we could get the wealth's catfish i have it on giblets but i don't know if i'm gonna catch one though Alrighty guys, that's going to be it. I could not spend the night uh, at the deep end here. That's what I'm going to name the episode. What lies in the deep? Uh, no sturgeons either, sadly. Um, but you know what? It was just fish after fish. Um, so I'm sort of happy with it. Uh, wow, look at this. 129 gram non-marker, 12 silver, 13 silver not bad um the mullet palingus worth okay money 44 45 silver each uh the flounders are also okay money bluefish not worth too much unfortunately even at 5.5 kg which seems like it's big not worth much at all uh so in terms of money it's an okay spot but I feel like you have a slight chance of catching a Pontic Shad Trophy there. And even a Mullet Palingus. Uh, but not a bad spot. I'm still in search of uh, the Sturgeon. Uh, I think I can say I found the spot for the Garfish that people suggested. They said, you know, go to the deep end, try there. And I tried the VIP JS 18 gram, and that was the one that got me. The two garfish, they are rare though, so don't expect to just farm them unless you are at another spot with another bait or lure that is much more uh, lethal <laughs> than, when, than what I was using. I also used a bunch of clams, no sturge. Look at this guy, Zim. Three of them he caught within hours of my recording here bunch of clams so he's found a spot zim uh and i need to know where that is uh whales catfish as well i don't know where the spot is look at that vibro tail people are getting it on i just don't know where they are so i'll keep exploring and see uh what else i can catch and uh, yeah thank you so much for tuning in if you have any tips uh, please comment below, subscribe for more awesome content. I will see you in the next episode. Until the next time, guys, I'll leave you with this.